Hey, what's good guys? Welcome back to TechSmart for yet another Indiegogo project. This one really caught my eye, and I think it has something that I really haven't seen before, something that you guys can get. It's linked down in the description, but what this is is a short throw projector that basically turns any surface into a touchscreen, and it goes up to 100 inches. Don't know about you, but that's sweet. If you guys wanna check it out, I'll leave a link down below. This caught my eye. I checked out some Indiegogo stuff about a year ago. Okay, the Puppy Cube. With a name like Puppy, you're a little in, whoa. You're a little intrigued. Okay, this was larger than I was expecting. But if it's all in here, that slot looks real interesting. Not too heavy, all right, we'll check. That, uh, that, that could have been it, but it wasn't. It's built like a tank, and it looks really cool. So here is Puppy. I feel like we should give it a name, Ev. It's, it's only right. You're naming it, what are you naming? Grover the Puppy. Boom. Ev nailed it with that name. So here's what's up with Puppy. It has a 10 point any touch kind of system, which allows you to make any surface pretty much touch screen. So in vertical mode, it'll go up to 23 inches, and then in horizontal mode, it'll go up to 100 inches. You heard that right, Ev. That 100 inch TV, now your dreams are here. Make your dreams come true. And that just sounded crazy when I even saw this, heard about this, and that's exactly why I'm making this video, to put those claims to the test. Oh. says puppy it's only like around three three and a half pounds and honestly if you're into the whole office whoa if you're into the whole making your office next level and really trying to get a cooler desk or just really have a cooler desk than anyone else you work with anyone else at school whatever this is it. We're gonna try this out on a few other surfaces I don't mind it it's really like a touch screen tablet that you get to make. So let me give you guys a quick spec breakdown of Puppy. It has 32 gigs of internal storage, quad core processor, four gigs of RAM. It's basically an Android device. So it has Android 6.0 Ev. Check that out. And what's really sweet is it has 36 millimeter dual stereo speakers. And what's really cool about this is it has a USB 3 port, HDMI, headphone jack, and then obviously where you charge it. And then a camera right at the top. So volume buttons, power on. In battery life from what I'm seeing is around 140-ish minutes, so just a little bit over two hours. Obviously, you need to charge it. In the future, I'm hoping these things get smaller and last longer. I mean, you have all your Android apps from the Play Store. Well, check out some Netflix. Watching Netflix on your table? Think about that for a second. This thing runs Android. Okay, it's pretty smart. And you can basically turn any surface into a screen. So if you want to have like a Twitter feed up and really customize it towards a new wall, you can do that now. I, lo I love it. 2018. So here's a little bit of actually my personal Netflix account. I have one for everyone here at TechSmart HQ in LA, and then one where this is just my all-time favorite shows that I've been watching this year. The Office, Trailer Park Boys, American Vandal, a little bit of Breaking Bad. That 70s show has quickly become one of my favorite shows just of all time this year. Black Mirror, of course. So let me know what you guys think about Puppy in the comments, but uh, I'm kind of digging it so far. So, just to go home, boom like that. Wait, is there, is there games? So to make it vertical, oh, you just turn it. Speakers. It's a little touch sensitive and you definitely have to get the hang of it, but it's pretty loud, I will be so honest. A little annoying, at least with just this noise, but hey, that's why we can mute it, Ev. So, won three out of the five games. Okay, one player, round one. Hump. I could see this actually becoming interactive with the right games. 
I don't want to say Fortnite on a table would be sweet, but you kind of get where I'm going. Pump, push, push, push. Okay. <gasps> what is? Jesus Christ, that's Jason Bourne. The one thing that I don't think we take into account is with games, you're actually just rubbing your finger against a surface really fast. And, you know, I would say I'm a pretty tough guy, but um, yeah, that kind of hurt after a little bit. But other than that, this is really fast and really awesome. So I actually got a game called Peppa's Pig fired up here. You immediately can just jump into anything. This is really an Android device. With Puppy, it starts at $7.99 on Indiegogo, and from what I can tell so far, it works. And it works really well. It actually knows when it's being picked up. And I think that's just battery conservation. It's really just a super powered Android smartphone in a box with a high powered camera. It has Bluetooth 4.0, it's Miracast, it's AirPlay compatible. I really wish and I can't wait for the next gen because I'm guessing battery life will probably be double if not triple. But I think what's really cool is you can actually turn anything into a touchscreen. And they say, up to a hundred inches. Let's find out. So this is what Puppy looks like, a hundred inch screen projected on a wall. So obviously it's not touch screen. The any touch only works from 23 inches. That's cool if you want to just take it really big, throw it on a wall. What I actually got going on is this plugged into laptop. Pretty easy, just HDMI in on both sides. Really crisp, I mean this is just a 720p HD video, 60 frames per second, but you can definitely tell the latency. Super low. So yeah guys, that is the Puppy Cube. If you guys wanna check it out, links down below. If you guys are new, make sure to drop a like, get subscribed by clicking that button right there. Make sure you hit it up on Instagram, it's just tech smart, and check out these other two videos at the end. And I'll see you guys next time.